Hi, my name is Phuong. I am an international student come from Vietnam. Like many international students, when I first came to Ireland, I need to deal with some cultural differences. However, thanks to his full advice and my teacher, now I feel much better and more confident. Hopefully, his advice can help you guys adapt to life in Ireland soon. Settling into a new country, a new place is incredibly difficult. And you're away from your family, your friends, not just that, you're away from the community that you're comfortable in. My advice is you have to try your absolute best. As in, you need to put yourself into situations you might not be comfortable with, it might be difficult, but you've got to try and get to know as many people as you can. Try and what your hobbies were in your country. Is there something similar to that here? Because if you're passionate about something, you'll meet people who are passionate about the same thing and then you can get friends. And trying to meet as many people from different communities, different countries and native Irish as well will make you get involved in the local culture and community much more, in my opinion. And I came to Dublin last year, October, so uh, it's nearly over one year. I have been in Ireland for two months. Uh, you know, uh, I came from China, so uh, when I uh, came to Dublin, I need to. I had to struggle so many um, culture shocks. Uh, my, in my country, the nightlife is very gorgeous. Uh, I mean, uh, you know, many many shops and restaurants open until uh, 10 to 11 p.m. Uh, some will even uh, open until uh, 2 a.m. the next day. But it's different. It's completely different in Dublin. Uh, many shops uh, close before 10 p.m. Uh, or 11 p.m. Uh, so I can eat. Uh, I just eat, could eat the fast food like uh, McDonald's. Uh, the first thing is about the food. Um, I, I, I try uh, some uh, uh, Irish food here and uh, they, have, they taste very uh, good. But uh, uh, I cannot eat uh, Western style food every day. So uh, I still have to go to Asian market uh, to shop for uh, ingredients to cook. Uh. So luckily in there are many uh, Asian markets uh, in Dublin and I can easily find uh, uh, the ingredient uh, familiar to me to cook uh, our, uh, my own food. Before I come to Dublin, I think uh, it's a kind of the modern city with the uh, skyscrapers and, uh, and with the very advanced uh, traffic system. But when I'm here, uh, it's, it's completely different what I'm imagined. Uh, I mean, no uh, skyscrapers, uh, no, uh, no subway underground. The thing I like most when uh, being here is the, the atmosphere. The environment here is very fresh and uh, trees are everywhere. In Dublin, um, many people like to say thank you uh, to the bus driver, but we never do in China. And uh, you know, sometimes when I'm in college, uh, some, some people uh, prefer holding the door for me when I, uh, I was in the, in the outside classroom. Uh, but I need to run over there, but actually I don't like it. But they, are, they all are the good people, uh, the good behavior, I mean. One of the difficulties I, uh, I had in, uh, during the first time in Ireland is the, the booking system uh, here. Uh, so every um, every time I, I need uh, to apply for, for example, for a visa or for, um, to open a bank account or to get a PPS number, I have to book an appointment. So it is different from my country. So uh, in my country, I just go straight to the office and uh, and fill in the form. But here in Ireland, I have to book it online before I go to the place. I still find some differences in uh, the culture here between Ireland and uh, my country, but uh, I'm getting used to the life here and I'm enjoying my life in Ireland. Mm -hmm.